Okay guys, this is wiring 101, and I'm not doing it, I'm just explaining it to you, and the junior's gonna do it. These are your wires. I have them cut at all different lengths. Ignore the white one right now. See, they're all three different lengths, so I can do all my splices, and then coat them, and not have a big bowl in the center. The white one is for the light, and right now the white one is gonna get teed into the hot when we put the key on and the light will come on that way. This is actually only temporary wiring because when we do the engine swap, it's gonna have an MSD unit and the MSD is gonna be inside the car over here, probably mounted. I'm gonna make a nice aluminum plate for the shifter and the MSD and any other switches you might require. Um, and it'll be wired to there. Right now, we eliminated that Ahuga horn that broke and we actually grabbed the wire from that for the tag signal. So that's laying here on the floor. I'm gonna use that. Um, we already have a ground that he has on the other side of the car. We're gonna be using that. And uh, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go into the fuse panel and get myself an ignition on hot. And we should be good to go. Repainted this fan. Had a couple of chips in it. There you go guys, that's the final outcome. I think that's a perfect place to put it. Doesn't cover up the little prindly thing. It doesn't turn with the shifter. Um, I said to Junior so we could mount it further back. Which we really don't have to. Uh, once you put a different shifter in the car. I said, but it's nowhere near your fingers and nowhere near the directional level. I said, I think that's a good spot. Um, especially for what the car is. You know what I mean? We're not going to the track trying to make money with it. I don't need it like right here in my face. Uh, good. I'm definitely happy with it. I think it came out good. You did good on the wiring. Good uh, on that bracket. So nice and clean, I think. You did good. <laughs>